Hey, hey everyone, and in this video I'll be showing you how to get a half jigsaw look and a half creepy victim look. Let's get to it. Okay, so first things, let's start with the brows. So choose the brow you want to do jigsaw and just apply one thin layer of Elmer's glue on top to block out the brows. Then you're going to go ahead with your beauty foundation and your beauty makeup on one side. Next, you're going to go ahead with white face paint. Just apply that all on one side of your face, extending that to the neck. You can go ahead and take that white and just make a line going all the way down so you have a nice separation. Next, we're going to go on to the clothes. So I'm just looking at a little reference picture of Billy, that creepy little doll, and I'm just taking some red here and I'm making a little bow tie. Just shade that all in with your red. Next, take a black face paint and just outline your bow. As well, take your black and go over the whole side of your shoulder there to kind of make it look like that little tuxedo that he has on. Take some more white and just fill that all in. I'm just taking some more black, just making a couple little lines for some detailing. You're then going to take some black eyeshadow and some brown eyeshadow and just shade everything in. The more you shade on that bow, the more it's going to look realistic. And then also add some white in the center to make it pop. Okay, we are looking good, almost done. So now we're gonna go on to the face. So same thing, look at a little reference of Billy and just outline the exact same features. Take your black paint and just kind of cut out the area so it looks like you have that kind of creepy little mask on. So the cheekbones are very sculpted. So we we're gonna do the cheekbones, the chin, the nose, and the brows. So same thing, just look at a little reference photo and then go ahead and draw your nose, your eyebrows, and those big cheekbones. Then just take a black and a gray eyeshadow and we're just going to go around all those little lines, those black little lines, and just shade everything in. So just keep shading and shading with your gray there. We can also move on to the eye here. Just grab your black face paint and draw a little circle there and you're going to completely color everything in with your black. So now we're almost done. We're just going to add a little bit more shading. So get your gray and your black and just go over those cheekbones and the chin. Next, get some red lipstick and go ahead and put that on both sides of your face there. And then I'm just extending my black line down so I keep that half and half illusion. And I'm also taking my black face paint and I'm just gonna go right in the crease of my lips there to make them pop a little bit. Next, of course, we need that iconic swirl. So just grab your red face paint and do one big swirl on your cheek. I'm going back in just to make it look a little bit more drippy. And then take your black face paint and just outline all of that. So next here, I did have some props. I went ahead and pre-made a little saw. This didn't stick the best. If you do want to skip this part, go right ahead. I did have to add a lot of blood around the latex just so you couldn't see any of the edges. Okay, and this completes our jigsaw look. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss more videos like this one.